Wheat is a grass that is widely cultivated throughout the world because of its edible seeds as a most commonly consumed staple food. The life of wheat can be divided into several stages. Planting is the beginning of the wheat's life, and it typically takes place in the fall or spring. The seed is planted in the soil, usually at a depth of about 1 to 2 inches. The soil should be well draining and have a pH between 6 and 7 for optimal growth. The first growth stage of wheat is germination or emergence, which takes place within a few days to a week after planting. Germination or emergence is the process by which the seed sprouts and begins to grow. As the seed sprouts, the embryo plant emerges from the seed coat and pushes through the soil. This stage usually takes about 7 to 10 days. After emergence, the plant begins to produce tillers, which are lateral shoots that develop from the base of the plant. Tillers will eventually produce additional heads of wheat, which is why this stage is important for yield. This stage usually takes around two to four weeks after emergence. As the plant continues to grow, the stem begins to elongate. Stem elongation is the stage when the plant reaches the maximum height, which can vary depending on the variety of wheat. This stage usually takes about two to three weeks. At the booting stage, the stem starts to produce the spikes or heads, which is the part of the plant that contains the grain. This stage typically occurs four to six weeks after emergence. The next stage is heading or flowering, which is when the wheat heads begin to produce flowers. The flowers are the reproductive parts of the plant, and they are responsible for producing the grain. This stage usually takes about six to eight weeks after emergence. Once the flowers have been pollinated, the heads begin to fill with grain. Grain fill stage is when the plant will start to put on weight and the grain start to mature. This stage typically takes about four to six weeks. During the last growth stage of ripening, the grains continue to reach maturity. The grains change color from green to yellow and become hard and dense. The plant is dried down. This stage usually takes about two to three weeks. Finally, wheat is ready for harvesting, which typically takes place in the summer. 
The grain is removed from the plant, and the kernels are separated from the straw. Overall, the life of wheat typically takes about four to six months from planting to harvest. Once the wheat is harvested, the kernels can then be further processed to flour for foods. It is important to note that the time for each stage of wheat's life may vary depending on the environmental conditions, such as temperature, moisture, and sunlight, as well as the variety of wheat being grown. Additionally, the time frame can be different based on the region and the farming practices. Around 800 million tons of wheat are produced worldwide each year. The top wheat producing countries include China, India, Russia, United States and Canada. The top wheat exporting countries are Russia, United States, Canada. Many foods are made from wheat or wheat flour, for example, breads, pasta, pizza crust, dumplings, cereals, pancakes, waffles, cookies, crackers, cakes. It is estimated that approximately 3 billion people globally consume wheat-based foods as a staple part of their diet. Wheat is a good source of carbohydrates, dietary fiber, and many essential vitamins and minerals. It also contains decent amounts of protein and healthy fats. However, people who are intolerant to gluten need to eliminate wheat from their diet entirely.